In today's video, I'm talking to you all about this really cool new feature to Adobe After Effects. So let's get right into it. Hey, what's up? It's Chris from Rooker Films. And in today's video, I'm talking all about this really cool feature that Adobe After Effects has launched in 2019. And that is Content Aware Fill. Now, if there is something in your shot that you want to remove, so let's say you got this shot of some grass and there's a phone on the grass. If you want to get rid of that, you'd have to track the entire movement take part of the grass from somewhere else, move that on top of the phone that you want to remove, track this into the scene, and it's just really long, really complicated, and just pointlessly, pointlessly long, but not anymore. After Effects has introduced this really cool feature called Content Aware Fill, and this basically analyzes your shot, figures out what's around the bit that you want to remove, and then generates a shape layer to go on top of the part that you want to remove, and it basically seamlessly removes that part of the footage. It's really awesome, it's really clever, and it's a really easy and fast way to remove something from your shot. So let's jump into After Effects and I'm gonna show you how to use the Content Aware Fill section to remove something from your footage. So once we're inside of Adobe After Effects and we have some footage imported, we're now ready to begin with the Content Aware Fill effect. So as you can see, in my example, I have some footage of a phone lying on the ground and we're gonna try and get rid of this phone using Content Aware. So to begin with, we first want to remove that part of the footage. So we want to draw a mask around the outside of that phone. So we go up to the pen tool and we're just gonna draw a mask around the outside of that phone. Now from here, we're gonna go into the mask on that video, mask one, and we're gonna change this setting from add to none, just so we can see what we're doing. Now we'll create a brand new keyframe on the mask path. So we'll press the stopwatch icon. We'll go one second forward in time and we'll update the mask so that it follows the movement of the phone. We'll go forward one more second and we'll update the mask again. Go forward another second, update the mask. And we're basically gonna keep doing this process for the entire duration of the shot, making sure that the mask follows the movement of the footage. And as soon as you've done that, as soon as the mask is perfectly following the part of the video that you want to remove, we want to go ahead and change this submenu from none to subtract. So we should have a black box in the middle of our footage. Now, this is where we're gonna use content aware fill to fill that black space. So on the right side of After Effects, we have content aware fill. So select this. In the fill method, we have fill object, surface or edge blend, but we want to select object. Now from here, we just want to select generate fill layer and you want to let the computer do its thing. After Effects is gonna analyze the footage. As you can see, that content aware fill has done its job and that big black missing square in the middle of our footage has been filled and that phone has been replaced. The content aware fill setting inside of Adobe After Effects is extremely powerful and really effective at what it does. So next time you need to remove something from your footage inside of, so the next time that you need to remove something from your footage, just load up After Effects, draw a mask around your footage, and then just use Content Aware Fill to fill in the missing part of the video. And there it is. That's how you remove objects from your footage right inside of Adobe After Effects. And there you go. If you enjoyed watching this video, then please do let me know in that comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe, check out the previous video, and I will see you tomorrow for another brand new video. Thank you for watching.